Hello and welcome back to Scorpio Tech. In this video we're going to take a look at one of the best gaming setup additions that you can make in 2021. Govi are at it again and this time they've created the Govi Glide Wall Light which is an incredible rival to the LifeX Beam. As well as this it boasts the same fantastic features that we've come to expect from Govi as well as being significantly cheaper than the LifeX Beam at just $90. The Govi Glide wall light is currently not available on the UK or Germany Amazon site, but I'll keep the description updated with the links when they're available to purchase in Europe. As always with Govi, the box is very well presented with a stunning product image on the front of the package, as well as showcasing key information and features that the Govi Glide offers. The Govi Glide has beautiful diffused RGBIC lighting effects, which can be fully controlled and customised by the Govi Home mobile app. As well as this, from the front of the packaging, we can see it offers a fantastic selection of 16 million colours, as well as various white light options and Alexa and Google support as well. Taking a look inside the box, we are greeted by a neatly presented set of items, including various paperwork such as the Govi Glide Quick Start Guide, which gives you a rundown of the setup process, which is thankfully extremely straightforward, as you'll see shortly. You also get a customer support information card if you run into any issues, and of course a standard user manual as well. And as I've said before, Govi have some of the most easy to understand manuals if you do require any help with the setup process or the product usage. At the bottom of the box you can see we're given 6 of the straight segments which are each 30cm in length. As well as this they have a really nice rounded finish to them which allows the light to diffuse more evenly as well as generally looking more aesthetic than the straight edges, but of course this does always come down to personal preference. Each segment also comes pre-installed with two sticky pads which are plenty strong enough to hold up these very light segments. At the top of the package we also have two smaller boxes, the first of which contains a power adapter which in this case is a US plug. But of course, once these are available on the European Amazon stores, they will come with your localised plug socket, so no need to worry about that, but for this video I simply used an adapter. In the second box we have a curved corner connection piece which allows you to get creative with your wall light design should you wish to do so. As you saw at the start of this video, I opted for three straight segments, followed by the angled piece and then another three segments to create this large L-shaped wall light to fit in with my gaming setup. Putting all this together was as easy as playing with LEGO thanks to the snapping connection style that Govi has opted for. The segments fit nearly seamlessly together which is fantastic as even when the Govi glide is turned off it still looks good and not out of place on your wall. The setup process took under 10 minutes total from the unboxing to piecing the segments together to attaching it to the wall. I've seen some really unique ways people use the similar LifeX beam so I cannot wait to see what people do with this Govi glide. So whilst I get everything set up, let's quickly cover some of the features that I've already mentioned as well as some additional ones. Those of you familiar with the Govi Home app will be aware just how intuitive and customisable these RGBIC strips are and there is absolutely no change here. There are a plethora of preset scenes and various music modes which you'll see shortly as well as a great DIY mode that lets you create and share your very own scenes to the community. Pairing your device to the Govi Home app is also as straightforward as you'd hope. Simply download the app from your favourite store, boot it up and hit the add icon in the upper right corner. Once there you can either search for your exact product or just use the Bluetooth connection option which from my experience works the best. With the Govi Glide already powered on it was immediately located via Bluetooth and then you can connect and rename it as you wish. You may have to connect to the Wi-Fi by putting in your router name and password but I did skip showing this step for obvious reasons. So this is the Govi Home app. From here you have access to incredible levels of customization and control over all of your Govi products. From basic settings such as brightness and setting timers, to other modes such as scenes, music and the effects lab, you have full control over every single aspect of your lights to perfectly match any theme, genre, mood or vibe that you want in your room. One of the first things I noticed about these lights once they had turned on, not that I could possibly miss it, is just how incredibly bright and vibrant they were at 100% brightness. I was worried with the amount of diffusion that the brightness would be somewhat reduced, but this was absolutely not the case. It casts a very nice soft glow onto the wall and surrounding areas of the room instead of casting a harsh light that you would usually get with undiffused light strips. As I said before, it's incredibly quick and easy to customise the Govi Glide to your liking thanks to a great application and a handy colour wheel to ensure that you get the exact colour that you're after. 
Possibly my favourite thing about the Goviglide wall lights is the incredible amount of preset scenes available. They look stunning and don't suffer from any flickering or defects, either in person or on camera, making this a viable option for a streamer's backdrop or just a general room decoration. These scenes are split into categories and include natural, life, emotion, festival and more, and guess what, if there's not one that you like somehow, then you can create your own or pick one from the community, it's quite honestly brilliant. The only issue I've had with the scenes, or possibly at all, is the fact that some of the scenes don't scale properly to the brightness levels. I'm not sure if this is something that I'm doing wrong, or possibly a bug, but even at 1% brightness, some of the scenes are very, very bright still. As mentioned before, the Govi Glide also features a music mode, so I'll be quiet for a minute and let the music do the talking. I've got to admit that the music mode works flawlessly. You can either select your phone as the microphone or the Govi Glide Hub itself, but both work well with little or no delay at all. There are a bunch of variants that you saw such as rhythm, bounce, hopping, energetic and more, which are all beautiful in their own right. And I can quite honestly say that this is my favourite tech product of 2021 so far, with a fair price point, outstanding feature set and just generally a fantastic addition to any room. As always the links are down in the description and thank you all so much for watching. As of recording this video the channel is nearly at 40k subs and I can't thank you all enough for the support. I hope to see you all in the next video. Goodbye.